Hi, I'm Chef Stuart O'Keefe, and today I'm going to make something that's very close to my heart. My mom would make this about once a week at home, and I remember just coming home after school on a cold winter evening and just digging into a great big bowl of chicken soup. So let's get started. Join me in the kitchen. So let me talk about this Dutch oven for a second. It has a five-ply construction. Because of this, it heats the base evenly, therefore cooking your food faster. And time is everything in the kitchen, so I love this pot. So I'm just going to heat it up. And with a two count of olive oil, I'm going to saute my bacon. So while that's heating up, let me tell you why I chose turkey bacon today. My mom would use regular bacon at home, but turkey bacon is healthier, it's less fat, less calories. And who doesn't like that? So let's add the bacon. Okay. So while that's browning, let's go over here to my vegetables. So I have onions, celery, and carrots. Now this is a mirepoix. It's a French term for the combination of these three ingredients. And these are used in soups, stocks, braising dishes. And this is why we're using it today, because we're cooking a soup. So we get our carrot, and we're gonna cut it in half like so. I want to cut into half inch pieces. Like so. Put it aside. And our celery in half. And this adds depth and flavor to the soup. So I'm going to put these into my that's a bowl. Right here. Now, let's Keep an eye on this and just make sure it's not going to burn. So now, my favorite little gadget, my genius gadget, my quick chef. So we're going to chop up the onion in this. So I'm just going to top and tail the onion, like so. Cut it in half. Take the first layer off the skin. We're going to quarter it again. Half to half, so we're going to quarter onion, place the blade in, lid on tight, give it a quick whirl. So our bacon is, is browning beautifully, so I'm just going to add this right in, and there we go. A combination of three ingredients that makes up a mirepoix, carrots, celery, and onion. So we're going to add these directly to the pan. We're going to give that a quick stir and we want our onions to brown. Here's an idea. How about cooking a large meal on a Sunday so you can freeze it and have it during the week, whether you're cooking for yourself or your family? You got it right here with Freezer Mates. So while they're browning, I'm going to get my other ingredients set and ready. So I have my potatoes. So when you go to the store, try and find baby potatoes. It's so much easier to cook with because you can just throw them into the stew. If not, and you get larger potatoes, you can just quarter them. Like so. And they're basically the same size as you can see. So you add those in there. And I'm going to get some thyme to the side, just a bunch of thyme. We have our seasonings and our mojo blend. And here's the fun part. We just get to add everything together with our chicken. So I'm just gonna stir the chicken in. Give it a stir. Drop our thyme in with our potatoes. Like so, it's so easy and it's just, uh, it smells beautiful. I'm just gonna season it up with some salt, some pepper. And of course, two tablespoons of the Mojo Seasoning Blend. And finally, we're going to add our low-sodium chicken stock. Turn the lid. We just add it right in. There we go. Now we just turn our heat up and high, and we're gonna bring that to the boil, turn it down, let it simmer for 35 minutes. Now just before you're finished, we're gonna add our spinach. 
and we add our spinach towards the end because we don't want the color of the spinach to go into the stew and make it a yucky green color and we want to keep the nutrients in the spinach so we leave that there until it's cooked put our lid on and there you go now grab yourself a cup of tea sit down for 30 minutes check back and add your spinach and you're done and remember eating healthy does not need to be difficult I'm Chef Stuart O'Keefe take care and eat well By the way, when you're in the kitchen, you need a great towel. I mean, why use all this when Tupperware's got you covered with their brand new microfiber chef towels? Why? Save yourself some money. Let's help the environment, people. It absorbs five times its weight in water. And from those messy spills to drying dishes, this is the only towel you need. And of course, it comes in two fantastic colors. <laughs>